the U.S. A group based out of Reedsburg personally knows that pain, and now they want to make sure others don't face it. Amy Reed joins us now to explain how they hope to help. Amy. Ketchum's Ride is a fairly new organization, about three years old. Every year, they hold a fundraiser to get money to send veterans' dogs to service dog training. I talked with one veteran the group worked with who said she doesn't know where she'd be without the help of Ketchum's Ride and the love of her sweet dog, Kino. Kino isn't just a best friend for Deborah McCollum. She's her rock, bringing her laughter. <laughs> As you can see, take a look at her ears. With her big personality. I got her. She had one ear down, and it stayed that way. The two have been together for three years, but if she could have it any other way, she would have changed that a long time ago. She is something I've been praying for since, basically since I got out of the service. That was 30 years ago, 1988, when McCollum ended her service with the U.S. Marine Corps, never serving on the front line, but leaving with scars nonetheless. But just take a look. A female in the service in the 80s? You know, you can figure it out, what we went through. It took her years in her time before Kino to ask for help, even longer to open up. Now with her rock by her side, it gets a little easier. Just Kino's body resting on her foot is enough. This makes me relaxed right now, otherwise I wouldn't be talking to you. McCollum said Kino couldn't have done this six months ago, lying still while kids played not too far away. It was training, gifted by a local group, Ketchum's Ride, that made it possible. They pay thousands for dogs like Kino to go to service dog training. And with that, they hope to provide lifelong partners who can help veterans dealing with the impossible. My girl. Yes, you are. It's something McCollum is grateful for. After serving as a hero herself, she needed one too. And she found it in a group bent on making sure she was okay. And in a dog content to stay by her side. I think she would do anything for me that I asked her to do. And with her by my side, I think I can do anything I, I want to do for the rest of my life. Ketchum's Ride is holding an online auction now. They have a lot of stuff to bid on on their Facebook page, and they're hoping to raise $20,000 to get eight more dogs for veterans like McCollum. If you want to help, we'll have a link to that Facebook page on our website with more information. All right. Thank you so much, Amy. The world's best-selling author, James